fool. Should have learned. I don't learn. From Avatar to Guardians of the Galaxy, Zoe Saldana has appeared in more major blockbuster franchises than most could dream of. Here are six roles we love from Zoe Saldana. Saldana made her movie debut in 2000, starring in Center Stage. The film followed 12 aspiring ballet dancers attempting to navigate their lives while reaching their dreams at the American Ballet Academy in New York. Excuse me? She heard you. We all heard you. You don't have to speak to her like that. Anyone can see she's working her ass off. That's enough, Miss Rodriguez. Fast forward to 2009, the actress wowed audiences in J.J. Abrams' highly successful Star Trek reboot. The film features the same characters as the original series on their maiden voyage aboard the starship USS Enterprise, but with a brand new cast. Saldana played Lieutenant Uhura, the role originated by Nichelle Nichols, and reprised the character through the film's two sequels, Star Trek Into Darkness and Star Trek Beyond. I'm impressed. For a moment there, I thought you were just a dumb hick who only has sex with farm animals. Wow. Not only. <laughs> 2009 also brought about a second breakthrough role for the actress, playing a key role in the highest grossing movie of all time, James Cameron's Avatar. Saldana played Neytiri, a native of the planet Pandora, and filmed her entire performance through motion capture. Bringing the groundbreaking film to the big screen paved the way for new age cinema innovation and played a key role in ushering in the digital 3D movie era. I see you. In 2010, she starred alongside her future MCU co-stars Idris Elba and Chris Evans in The Losers. The film revolved around members of the CIA who, after being betrayed and left for dead, seek revenge on those who targeted them for assassination. I don't want to hurt you. You're not going to. Oh, yes, I am. Then there was the 2011 action thriller Colombiana, in which Saldana starred as a woman who grows up to be an assassin after witnessing the murder of her parents as a child. As a trained killer, she seeks to hunt down and avenge her parents' death. Okay, what do you want? I want you exactly where you are. And then, of course, there was Saldana's turn in the mega-successful Guardians of the Galaxy for the Marvel Cinematic Universe. The actress played Gamora, the adopted daughter of MCU's biggest antagonist Thanos, and served as the love interest for Peter Quill, played by Chris Pratt. Saldana played the fan-favorite character through the film's sequels and Avengers offshoots until the character met her untimely demise in Avengers Infinity War. You failed. And do you want to know why? because you love nothing. Other standout roles included ones in Crossroads, Drumline, The Terminal, and so many others. For more on Zoe Saldana and other roles we love, keep watching The Hollywood Reporter News.